welcome back to our channel today. You guys, we are excited that you are here in the car with us. Oh yeah. <laughs> On this beautiful, what day is it? Wednesday? Yeah, Wednesday. Wednesday, Wednesday evening. We kind of had a busy day. Yes. We've been getting caught up on quite a few things. Jared's busy with work stuff most mm -hmm. of the day. So we we're just opening up the vlog today. But before we jump in to today's video, a big thank you for all your sweet words about Jared and just this past week. It was kind yeah. of a whirlwind, lots going on, lots of testing, lots of results. There's still some things going on in the background that we'll fill you guys in on when the time is right. Yep. But just a huge thank you for just always being so sweet and supportive with yeah. us. We just love you guys. We really, really appreciate it. And we apologize that our videos have kind of been a little spotty lately. Yeah, it's but, life. <laughs> yeah. But, uh, you know, as like we learn more over the next couple of weeks, um, you know, hopefully we'll be kind of like more regular after that. Yes, yes, yeah. yes. So thank you for being patient with us. We hope you're all having a fantastic day, as Jerry would say. <laughs> yeah, oh my gosh, but it is another beautiful day here in Florida. We are sitting in a parking lot right now, mm -hmm. as you can tell. We have a few things we need to get done tonight. Well, I should say I do. My sweet, sweet husband is tagging along with me for the ride. How lucky am I? <laughs> <laughs> but I have a church event that is tomorrow that I am in charge of in terms of decorating and getting set up and so of course I am outside right now of Dollar Tree I like to always kind of start with any parties things like that at Dollar Tree kind of see what they have my theme is like fallish fall colors pumpkins so I need to do a few tables which is kind of fun you guys you guys know my love for like decorating and things like that so I'm excited I don't know about this one you know his favorite <laughs> place is the dollar store yeah. <laughs> but also right next to it is a place called five below and I've heard of this I think it's where everything is five dollars and below hence the name but we've never been in that store so I kind of want to go in there first kind of scope it out see what they have then head into Dollar Tree and then also next door to that this is like the ultimate party stop is <laughs> party city which is a party store here in florida so yeah we're gonna, we're gonna head get on in we're gonna get the goods and have some fun today well you guys didn't find too much in five below it was kind of a fun though it was a way cool story kind of like walk in it was like yeah. neon lights everywhere There's and little sections like a huge candy section food <laughs> they had clothes kind of anything you can really think of yeah. I will say I think some of the stuff's probably not worth five dollars <laughs> yeah I know I was looking at some of the stuff I was like I can't believe they're charging five bucks for this <laughs> yeah but then other stuff I feel like oh that would be fun to yeah. like take a little kid in that's and, true like, on the flip side so maybe you stuff. average out like you know it's worth it in terms of decorations and party stuff not a ton there to choose from yeah. there a few like little fall leaves but wanted to check out Dollar Tree first before I got those to kind of see they also didn't have a ton of different like tablecloths or party settings stuff like that they had yeah. some like gift bags and things like that but I thought they might have a little more of that but anyways that was fun to see that was cool so now we are heading in to a Dollar Tree and we'll Ooh. see what they have I mentioned this in a previous video. The second that October hits, it's Christmas season. <laughs> Check this out. All their fun Christmas stuff, but I did find a few more fall things. You guys look how darling. Okay, so these napkins are those kind of fall and fun. I like the pattern. And then they have these cute longer tablecloths with like a fall pattern. I thought these might be cute for like the serving tables, the big long ones that I mm -hmm. have to do, the banquet tables. So pick up a few of those. Let's see what else we can find. <laughs> okay, so I found these little fabric swatches. These are really cute. I'm thinking like this in the center, because I'm gonna do fresh flowers. Is the centerpiece with maybe some like little pumpkins around it or something like that. Mm. And I think this might be cute, just like gathered up in the middle to kind of center each of the round tables. What do you yeah. think? Does that look folly? I think it's kind of go folly. with the napkins ish. Yeah, it does look really good. Kind of different than just your typical like straight orange. I think cute <laughs> I don't know I like it <laughs> okay I love getting my vases here a dollar 25 that's a freaking good deal I cannot beat this I know that's I'm a great deal just a simple round I was gonna do the thinner but I Ooh. think I like this a there's kind of cool <laughs> okay the cylinder 
What do you got there? Okay, you guys know I'm conflicted. <laughs> I just saw this. Look how darling this gingham is. The black and white. It's like, do I want to do tie that in something? Oh, that'd be kind of cool. But it just doesn't go with like these light colors. No. I'd have to do just like this with orange and yellow or something like that. Yeah. Darn it, but head to your Dollar Tree if you're looking for this. This is so cute. They have all their Christmas stuff out now. Ooh, look how pretty this ribbon is. Ooh, it's that like, is nice. It's like a yeah, it's like the felt, dark green, like a forest velvet green. Velvet ribbon. That's so oh, it's velvet. Pretty. Yeah, it's velvet. Oh, nice. It's really pretty. This is in the three dollars section. I actually had no idea about any of this stuff, and so the fact there's like a three dollars section, a five dollars section, that's all new to me. Look how cute. <laughs> I think we need this little green tree. Oh, you know what? Yeah, I think I'd be okay with that. Oh my gosh. Uh, yeah, I didn't even actually know they had a five dollar section. Yeah, that's crazy. Wow. These are actually kind of cute. This great greenery. Okay, I found some little signs, you guys, too. Look how cute. This is like a little grateful one that says, Hello Fall. And then I'm going to put some candy, of course, like candy corns and little pumpkins and some little dishes, I think, at each table, too. But these are darling. Look at that fresh apple cider. I can't come to the dollar store without getting some candy, of course. I thought these were really cute. I love the Werther's Original, the Chewy Caramels. If you guys have not tried these, they are so good. I'm going to put these along with the candy corn and stuff in a little bowl at each table. I think it might be kind of fun. <laughs> Well, we got a slew of goodies at Dollar Tree. Now we're at Party City, and this place is like Zurchers out in Utah. This place is awesome. All the colors <laughs> you can think of. So I'm trying to think if I do just basic white tablecloths on all the round tables where people will be eating with this, or if I do like a yellow-ish, more fall-y, or they don't have the light orange, so it's really either this, I feel like, or white. Hmm. And I need okay. them in rounds. Let's, oh yeah, these are rounds, right? Last yeah, last time we got them. One time I got them, yeah, in rectangles. <laughs> or, because I need bowls, because we're doing like a soup and salad buffet, so I could do like bowls one color, plates one color to kind of like mm. get some dimension. Hmm. I just found this pretty cream color that I think would look a little bit better than just white. And, and or just yellow. Or just yellow. Yeah. yeah. Meet in the middle. Compromise. Right. And they have the round, which is awesome. Nice. So we'll grab these. I'm gonna do five rounds. Five rounds with eight chairs a table. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Cool. We'll get that. Now we need a layer. We need to pick out like the bowls and the plates and everything like that. That's gonna go look good. I'm excited. But he's making fun of me again. I, thought, <gasps> I thought it was so cute. Just all of a sudden he's like, Britt, we should get these just for our guests. Look how cute. It's like a little pineapple napkin that says welcome on it. They're foil stamped, it says. <laughs> foil stamped. Yeah, foil stamped guest towels. That's oh, cool. Oh, I like it, babe. I like it. If you want it, we should get it. Whatever. <laughs> it's cute. So we debated on yellow or orange, and it was kind of a lot. So. We're thinking now, I like how we say we're. <laughs> yeah. We're thinking maybe gold plates could be cute, kind of tie in, you know, more of a folly outfit. So this is like a cream tablecloth, then we have the little plates, <laughs> and then on top is the bowl. And the bowl with the napkin, what do you think? Is that, I don't know, is that so random? I don't know. I don't know if I'm loving the white still, but I do like that gold. Not the white bowl? Yeah. Ooh, maybe we could do cream bowls. Ooh, the cream there we go. There we go. So they actually may be out of the cream bowls. No! <laughs> I really don't see any. I see the mini plates. No! Oh, dang it. Well, you guys, Jared may have just saved us. <laughs> he found this is like more of a heavy duty. It's a little bit, it's not stark white, but it's more of like. It's kind of like an off white. Yeah, a little bit of an off white, but yeah. I think that would look really good with it. It looks really good. And then if we did kind of the same color cup yeah. next to it. I think that looks good. Like I mean, from it? far away, it looks good. I like it. Okay. Got 
got all of our party supplies. Thanks to Jared. Yeah, that's right. I mean, Jared pretty much planned the whole thing, came up with everything. So, so if it looks really bad tomorrow, she's basically saying Stop. that it's my fault, but that's okay. I, think, I can take blame for that. I think it's gonna come together. I'm excited <laughs> to go and get, I'm gonna buy some like little pumpkins and then do some pretty fall flower arrangements. So come back tomorrow. I'm gonna finish getting that stuff tomorrow and then get it all set up tomorrow because it's tomorrow night. So that'll be really fun. <laughs> But you guys, we are starting a new little tradition. New little family tradition. We've done this the past few nights, especially with the weather just cooling off here. I, I don't know if you can hear the wind in the I know. It's so cool. Right now. This never gets old to us, so it always feels like we're on vacation. We love it. We're starting two new little traditions. Two new traditions? Yeah, that's I don't right. know this first one. <laughs> but what I was going to say is we have been doing this little sunset walk at night. Jared found the most amazing place to see the sunset on the water here. It and is beautiful. Right near the park, hence yeah. why Finn is full Yeah, full on. charge ahead. You see this, he is just charging you guys. He is Pretty like much walking us. <laughs> so far ahead, we're like the running. The only <laughs> route he will just plow through. We even went to the park this morning with Finn. Like, <laughs> let him play around, run after squirrels, let's lift him up in trees, that sort of thing. It was so, oh, I made a little reel about it. I'll probably post it here on YouTube as well, do a short, so go check out our short speed. But you guys, Jared is the cutest ever. He literally Literally lifts Finn up by the squirrel in the tree and Finn goes crazy. He has the biggest smile on his face. It was like the cutest thing ever. I had to make a reel. I look over and I just see Jared holding Finn running from like tree to tree. Finn was on cloud nine. He was loving it. <laughs> <laughs> it was so cute. So anyways, we decided with the weather being so nice here, we are going to try and do these little sunset walks That's every right. night, whether it's down here to the beach. Now, do you want to hear the second? Yeah, I'm tradition? actually curious what the okay, second one is. Okay, the second tradition is that I want to take the fun way home always. Oh. So what I mean by okay. that is that A1A is kind of like the uh, PCH, if anyone's familiar with that, but yeah. it's, it's the road that like divides like the ocean and us. And so, the city. Yeah. and the city, yeah. So, I was telling Brittany, anytime that we can, we should take the fun way home, which is A1A. Along the ocean. Along the ocean, because okay. you get to see like all the palm trees, you get to see the beach, the ocean. It's just really, really pretty, and we got to soak that in for as long as we are here. I know, it's true. So, we did yeah. take that long way home on the way home from running those errands tonight. And yeah. It's just we roll down the windows, we have music playing. It's just like a nice little And it is, it is. It is a longer way home. It takes it about an extra five minutes. But as Brittany said, it's a total de-stressor and it just is so pretty and it's just so relaxing. So I was telling her, we gotta do that. Why don't we I'm home? laughing, I'm trying to stay in the shop, but Finn is pulling <laughs> so hard. So I found this little secret place, kind of secret, I guess you could say, but it's in the park, but we never come this way. It's like behind the tennis courts, and like there's a floating dock here that no one ever goes to, it seems like. Oh, it's so pretty. <laughs> Let's go see, Puppers. <laughs> I know, it's so beautiful. Look at this. Oh, a crab. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh my gosh. No, no, no. That was close. <laughs> that will pinch wow. You. That is crazy. That's a crab. That's so cool. <laughs> but look at this view. Oh my gosh. Look at the reflection. <laughs> it's so beautiful. It's and you guys can kind of see that sunset off in the background there. I know. It's in between the two buildings. Yeah, we got here a little bit late. Usually, yeah. it's right in between those buildings. Yeah, when it's right in between those buildings, this whole thing just lights up oh. golden yellow. It's Pretty. So pretty. Jared's gonna fly the drone. Yes. We gotta bring the drone to fly yep. the drone at sunset. We get sunrises quite often, but we don't really film drone the sunset. Yeah. Much, this is beautiful. We it's love it. Perfect little piece of paradise right here.
in, you can probably hear all the people starting to come to the park. There's pickleball courts over there, tennis courts, and it is packed. Pack. Because the weather has dropped, I feel like everyone is coming outside right now. But Oh, you got to. It feels amazing now. Look at this right here. The most beautiful sunset. The reflection right here. I was trying to get the reflection. Jared was flying the drone. and It was so cool. This boat was like docking at the same time. I it know. It was like awesome. And it was so fun. I was out here on the dock. So with this lady and her son was just coming to pick her up in their boat. And they were going home. I was like... This uh, Florida lifestyle is just is another cool world, life. that's for sure. We've been talking a lot about that in the last few, I would say, yes. weeks. Especially the boat show is coming up. And if you remember, we've gone to the boat show twice twice now two yeah. years in a row so yeah. i think that's another tradition we need to keep going is go to the boat show it's so cheap and it's honestly a lot of fun oh you it's know? so cool to see all and the boats. with your ticket the water tax is included oh well thank yeah. you there you go there you, there you, go. Go. <laughs> <laughs> you are planning to come to the boat show if you're local here in florida it is this coming week and yeah. slash weekend so i think it starts on wednesday or thursday of next week yeah and then or goes if you until... guys just happen to be coming here for vacation and you don't you're looking for fun stuff to do it's yeah the boat show. it's awesome and he has been trying to talk me into a boat yes. many of you guys know this a small one a small boat yeah. even just one like kind of a ski boat would you call it I yeah don't know. yeah kind of like the one you saw i mean his dream it. is to live on a catamaran we all know that that would be my dream i would give up everything to live on a catamaran oh everything huh yes everything not everyone everything <laughs> oh okay good good save good save so anyways we're actually kind of excited because we do we might go, you know, just kind of gander at some of the boats. Yeah. We we definitely need a new car. There's other things we need, but yeah, even of, something like that would be perfect. Having a boat out here, Super I mean, look chill. at this life. Just like a fun little lifestyle. Finn's having a heyday. Yeah. Just checking everything out. The tennis court lights just came on over here. This is a really fun park. This is, of course, Finn's running from every tree on the way over. I, there's something about it just seeing like the palm trees next to these big trees with like the big branches coming out good boy finn let's go and now finn's favorite part the trees do you see him you guys he will literally run from tree to tree watch this he'll like check every tree to see <laughs> and it's the cutest thing beware come, come see this one let's go oh, yeah. <laughs> What do you see? What is it? Oh, oh my gosh. I think they all went to sleep, bro. Come on! Oh, no. Good boy. Oh, no. 